Good afternoon, beautiful. We're having a beautiful afternoon here, the family and I. It's time to take back control of our health. It really, really is time. So I want to share something that I am just genuinely excited about. You know, if you've been watching me for a while, you know that I've been searching. I've been searching for so many years and I, I try this and I try that and everything has taught me something. And I've always had this innate wisdom, some sort of deep inner knowing that I wasn't able to explain because I didn't have words for it. I don't know if any of you can relate to that. I just knew, I just know things. And I've been getting, I think this past summer, I got really frustrated and disheartened with my, just with physical health, with the way life was falling apart, with feeling trapped here. Everything was just getting really, really heavy. And I had this knowing that I'm this beautiful, beautiful soul who's powerful, who's is on a really profound mission of self-healing so that I can help others heal themselves. I'm here to be a leader and just there was no flow and there was no ease for a while. I want to talk about human garage today. So I came across them after I moved to the cabin, after I left my partner some time. Uh, I was on Instagram a lot, I was using it as inspiration. Not necessarily, not for distraction, but I, I would go there to get the beautiful messages because there are so many beautiful people out there. So I would sort of track them down and... Uh, and go on there daily when I just felt like there was nothing left to live for. And I came across Human Garage and they do something called fascial maneuvers. And I, I've done them off and on for the past year and a half. I've, I've tried diving deep, but it just wasn't the time. And then about three weeks ago, you know, I was hardly able to walk. My knees were so bad. My hip hurt so badly. My shoulder hurt so badly. It was like fall time. I was like feeling the pressure of not having food for the winter and no water for the winter and was hurting too badly to, to prepare. You know, life was just, a little bit challenging a few weeks ago. I wasn't taking very good care of my body, diet-wise, wasn't sleeping. And I've been longing, I have been longing for the time when the time will come for me to work on my physical health. And it just, it just clicked into place. I, I made a decision Okay, no, it's not. It wasn't me making a decision. It was like, it was the time was right. The time was right in that exact moment whenever I made that, made the decision to, okay, it's time to work on my physical health now. You know, I want to do so much more. I want to be present more for myself. I so badly do not want to live a life full of pain, physical pain. You know, I, I see my family, I hear them, I feel their pain, and I am just so determined not to go down that path. And this summer, I really felt like I was just, you know, I'm just going to end up like my dad, <laughs> you know, or like various other aunts and uncles. And I have a really hard time accepting that, accepting that to be my reality. I want to do what I can to not go down there. So I decided to give fascial maneuvers a really serious go. And I've been doing them now once or twice a day or even more for 
three weeks, I think. I was going to go back and check, but um, something like that. And I've never listened to any of their podcasts. I've, I've never just, I just have listened to their like, their, their 90 second blurbs and they're powerful enough but I decided you know what I'm actually gonna I'm gonna start listening and see what he has to say because his short blurbs are just really captivating and and so much new information and the information that's coming is just it, it boggles my mind to be honest with you so I listened to one podcast <laughs> the first the first podcast ever and I was just hooked. You know, I say sometimes how I don't, I don't force things anymore. You know, I sit and I wait for something to drop into my life. And when you start doing that, when you, when you stop with the pushing, you stop with the forcing, you, you stop trying to force healing or to, to, you just want to find a healer or a therapist so badly you're like reaching out all over the place when you actually stop that and you sit and you be and you take care of yourself while you're waiting when something drops in holy shit man do do things drop in and it's just wham you know that it his words just hit me and i knew that i had reached another another level of coming home Don't knock the tripod over, Kosh. <laughs> Troublemaker. Three weeks later, after continuing to, you know, follow them, do their, do their maneuvers, to listen to what they have to say, I feel like I am ready. I feel like I am stepping deeper into who I truly am meant to be. And that is really, really profound for me. One of the family members and I talk about quite regularly how we think that since we're in between the two worlds, we don't know what's coming. We have all those modalities that we're currently in or like a little bit behind us so many different things and all of them are beautiful in their own way but we have no idea what's coming and it's going to take something new because we are really stuck right now you know let me rephrase that a little bit there are so many people who are so stuck there are some of us who are not stuck i'm like i go in between stuck and not stuck right so i'm like kind of veering around right now It seems like just utter chaos out there. It's not. We are, we are gaining momentum. The, you know, the collective consciousness of light workers and light beings and those who are stepping into their truth and figuring out who they really are. We are gaining strength and it's such a beautiful process. I lost my train of thought, so I'm just going to keep talking. <laughs> if this isn't coherent, I'm sorry. It's just my it's just my way. Right. Uh, uh, new modalities. So, Human Garage. There's there's two founders. Well, there's four. There's four. There's Gary, his wife Cynthia, Jason, and his partner. I'm not sure if I'll say her name right. I've actually never seen her on a video asia asia they have figured out or they are figuring out they're in the process of figuring out how the body actually works and and they say that it's nothing everything everything that we've been told everything that we've been taught everything that we believe that's not truth we're taking a complete radical shift with this new information on how the body actually works and how it functions and how it all relates together. And I think it's ancient wisdom. I really do. I really do think that Gary is accessing ancient wisdom, is channeling it, and is now teaching it. 
And I was listening to something from him yesterday where he was saying, you know what, at first, I didn't want to be the man. I didn't want to be doing this. I'm like, oh, okay, I can relate to that. <laughs> I can so relate to that. You know, I keep talking about how having a YouTube channel and being making myself vulnerable, being vulnerable in public and, and being a leader and and learning and growing and showing you guys in real time has just been so uncomfortable for me. And it's like, I, I don't know that I really want to be doing this. And over the past couple of weeks, that thought has been shifting to, you know what, I'm ready to further step into this, whatever that looks like. I'm ready for the next, for the next thing. And I'm starting to feel energy swirling around me again and I'm starting to feel my power come back and I'm starting to feel excitement and I'm starting to feel I'm starting to feel I was walking around my forest here yesterday thinking about what I wanted to talk about in this video and I was just giggling I was just walking around with such a huge smile on my face I'm so excited about this you know I'm the queen of self-care. I am so passionate about it. I'm so passionate about facing your shit and working it through and getting to the next level and taking care of yourself. And Human Garage is exactly what I've been looking for. I've tried all sorts of things, all the free things, okay? Uh, tapping, shaking, um, different energy, energy work. I've, I've seen a shamanic practitioner. That wasn't free, but I also had some energy work. I've cleaned up my diet. I exercise to the best of my ability. I'm working at, lately I've been working at connecting soul to body, you know, realizing that I am soul in a body. And there's just been something missing. And I thought, it was community, you know, and it's definitely a part of it. I am definitely missing community, like either in-person community or someone who can mentor me, you know, someone who is further along on their journey who will take, who will take me under their wing and help me figure some of this stuff out because, oh, okay, emotional again. This is so much bigger than me. And I'm finally getting to the point now where I don't feel responsible for you guys. I don't feel responsible for you as a family. I don't feel so pushed to pushed into having this really big, intense purpose. All I need to do is to take care of myself and then let the rest just shine out, right? Everyone is responsible for their own shit. I can push kicking and screaming as hard as I want, and that, that won't change anything, you know? So I am, it's not a useful energy to feel deeply responsible for people. You know, you either take it or you leave it. We'll walk beside each other or we won't, and that's fine. Lost my train of thought again. <laughs> Human garage is the missing link. So my whole thing is we need to be reducing our stress, you know, and that's really the way I have lived my life for the past few years now. I learned about stress and the effects it has on the body, on the mind. It dysregulates everything, our sleep, our diet our routine, our relationships, you know, our hormones. It dysregulates everything. When we are stressed, we are not able to hear. Like if you're really stressed right now, chances are you won't really be able to hear what I'm saying. If you're really stressed, you can't think clearly. You can't verbalize clearly. It affects every single part of our life. It affects every single part of our being. You know, because we are soul in a body having a human experience, if the human body is stressed, 
It doesn't allow for our soul to shine through. It doesn't allow for us to connect to our higher selves. It just really allows for suffering and pain. And I don't want to live like that. My suffering and pain has diminished so greatly already and I just want it gone and I want it gone for good and I think I can go a whole lot further. I really, really do. So I've been talking lately, I don't know, past month, month and a half about how we have two cups, right? Cup number one, this is when we get we fill up with stress and everything sloshes over. Anger, rage, depression, anxiety, darkness, just dysregulation, the inability to regulate our emotions, you know, exhaust, exhaustion, insomnia. You can't even hold still without it sloshing over because we, don't, we aren't actually capable of, of holding anything super still, right? So when this cup is full and overflowing, this second cup, the cup where, which is love and self-care and honoring ourselves and self-respect, this is empty. Okay, so we need to be emptying this cup. As we empty this cup, this cup fills up, you know, and we have more self-love, we have more self-compassion, and we can do self-care. And human garage that is what they are all about it's about lower, lowering the stress and they do it with something called fasci fascial maneuvers it's twisting into different body positions uh creating pressure breathing and by doing that it releases stress and for some people it's instantaneous some people have to work at it a little bit more, but it absolutely works. It absolutely works, and I am so excited about it. They started off having a, a clinic where they'd where people would come in and see them, and they realized that that wasn't really the most effective way to help to reach a lot of people and they wanted to change um, what they did to empower the individual to help heal themselves so their mission statement is to help what is it to something about reaching a billion people to help heal themselves and all it takes is 15 minutes a day everything is open sourced which is i just massive respect you know, if you've been listening to me for a while, you know how I feel about people charging for healing. Human Garage, Gary Jason, and their partners, they have it right. And I am just so honored to have come across them. And I am really excited to be part of something that is way bigger than myself. You know, I have a tiny, tiny little YouTube channel in my little corner of the world, right? And it's beautiful. And it's, it's very powerful. Okay, let's get involved with Human Garage and, and really, really start to work at raising our vibrations to work at our health and be part of a, a collective consciousness that is going to be, like right now it's millions of people big. It, this truly has so much momentum. I, I'm just, I'm like almost too excited to sleep the past few days. <laughs> you know, I just, I feel motivated. I feel, I feel okay. We got to jump on the bandwagon now. Now is the time to start taking control of our health in a really big, profound way. So what I'm thinking is, uh, those of you who this resonates with, let's, let's join forces, let's say for two months, and let's do this intentionally. They have an app that you can download on your phone, or you can access it on your laptop. 
and they do something called resets. So they have a one day reset, three day reset, seven day reset, and the 20 day reset, 28 day reset. And they are really good at teaching. You don't need any special equipment. All you need is a little bit of space. It's good for all levels. Um, they, ex they explain it clearly and concisely. There should be absolutely no pain when you do it. So if, if, and there's no right or wrong, which I just love too. I've done yoga and I find it really complicated. And if you want to be a teacher of it, you need to take a really long, um, teacher trainer or, uh, you need to take a teacher course. <laughs> I'm not saying it right. And it's even then yoga is a whole lifestyle. So is human garage, but this is simplicity. You know, this just fits in with what I, how I want to live my life, how I do live my life, what I, what I think, what I'm teaching. It just fits in really well. So I'm thinking that this will definitely resonate with some of you. So why don't we take two months? You know, not everyone's going to do, uh, not everyone's going to get through all the resets in, in like three days. You, you don't have to do it three days in three days, if you know what I mean. So the next two months, let's gather together on the Human Garage app and let's find each other. I'm Molly Anwar on there. Uh, A-N-W-A-R. Find me. I checked into it and we can't form community on that app, it doesn't have that capability. We would have to go off there and do it some results. So I just say, let's just find each other. I'll float around and I'll I'll find you guys and I'll encourage you guys. Just let me know that you're on there. Um, I, a few weeks ago, I did make the commitment to do this. And I was, I've only been on the app now for a few days and I really like it. It's it's easy to navigate. It's user friendly. They have journal prompts. I'm doing the journal prompts. I'm, I'm really doing a deep dive into it. I'm really interested in becoming a coach for it someday for Human Garage. Uh, I was on, I met some beautiful women from Human Garage, like their coaches on Human Garage. I had a talk with them yesterday evening in one of their um, information evenings. And I felt so comfortable, you guys. You know, it's not often that. I go into a group of people and feel comfortable and at ease. And I did. And I think there's a lot of potential for me here for growth, for expansion, to keep spreading love, to receive love, to, to receive motivation, to, to take myself to the next level. Like I said, to go deeper inside myself and, and just go deeper into who I really am meant to be and to further um, fulfill or work on my purpose here for this lifetime. You don't have to do the resets. You can just do, uh, you can just do, they, they have an amazing YouTube channel as well. So you can check out their YouTube channel. And if you don't, aren't interested in doing the app or, you know, connecting with the, um, the Blue Eyed Molly family on there, go to their YouTube channel and they, their routines are 15 minutes. Some of them are longer, but they have an upper, upper reset, a lower reset. You can do them sitting, you can do them standing, you can modify them. The possibilities are endless. Um, the app has many classes that you can attend. I was at one today that was um, for trauma. It was so gentle and it was just breathing and feeling deeply into the core of your being and just helping let go what is ready to be let go. So many of us are dealing with deep-seated trauma. So many of us are disassociated and we can't even we we have lost the ability to feel into our bodies at all we have lost the ability to feel we're just numbed out and we do that because we don't feel safe because there isn't a safe space for us to express ourselves we've been shut down by others so many times that we've just started shutting ourselves down 
This needs to stop. I want this to stop. I want for all of us to feel the freedom that I'm starting to come online with. You know, yes, it still comes and goes. You know, I, I get very squirrely. I go off my rocker occasionally. I <laughs> swing back and forth chaotically. But compared to who and what I was, I'm experiencing so much freedom and so much more ease. There's a, I think there's going to, there's going to be an opportunity for me to start doing uh, classes on there if I want. So I'm really interested in that. That would totally float my boat because I have been wanting to, to do classes of some sort. And it's without a website of my own, it's just not possible because I need people to sign up. Right. And I think being, like I said, being part of something that's so much bigger than myself, it's just relieving for me right now because they have a website they have the format they have everything i just love joining in and being a participant you know i love being a facilitator but i also love and miss being a participant and just being able to receive so it's such a beautiful experience i will see what my notes have to say So the, it's 28 days because it takes 28 days to uh, rehabituate our stress level. Oh, Foxy's just move the camera a bit. Uh, if, you, if you chip away at it a little bit every day, you know, you, you empty your cup today you empty your cup tomorrow or at least maybe today you'll empty it a quarter of the way tomorrow you'll empty it a quarter of the way the next day it might not empty at all and the next day maybe it's half and you like you slowly chip away at it right for most of us change is not instantaneous i do believe in miracles miracles have happened to me but for most of us it's just slow and steady and then all of a sudden you'll have like a burst a burst of speed and you'll go through exponential growth and you'll go back to slow and steady again and so that's why they have the 28 days you know the the first the the one three and seven day resets are to educate yourself and to get yourself familiar with it they they go they have a they do a great job of explaining everything and then the 28 days is okay we're going to consistently work at lowering or emptying our stress cup every single day and then that rehabituates us to a new level of stress and then that allows us to heal and the healing is amazing you know right now our bodies are so stressed there's no healing you know we just are feeling so chronically fucked up all the time and part of this let's take control of our health back is also let's just take con control back you guys please jump on the bandwagon with me let's take control back you know, it starts with us. Don't worry about what anyone else is doing. Don't worry about the government. Don't worry about the grocery stores. Don't worry about this or that or the other. Let's take care of this. That is how we can say, fuck you, man. I'm taking control back of my own life. You know, I am going to learn about what is truth. I am going to figure out my personal truth and I'm going to live it. So that's what I want to inspire you guys to do. Let's live our truth together. Let's figure out our truth together. I am totally backing up human garage. You know, you've heard me say over and over and over and over again, turn off, turn off the YouTube, turn off the phone, put the computer away, get rid of all distractions. I have now found something that is really worth taking a look into and doing it and they're, they're they say this isn't for life 
You know, you don't need to be doing these maneuvers every day for the rest of your life. We can get ourselves to the point where our bodies will just, once our stress levels are, you know, minimal, we don't need to do it every day. This isn't something that they're trying to hook you on for every day, for the rest of your life. They want to help heal us so that we'll be healed, so that we'll be whole, so we'll be complete. And I want to do this for myself so that soul has more room in here. So that I can be more joyful and bubbly and ebullient. I just love that word, ebullient. On a more regular basis. And not so much discombobulated. I also love that word. So like more ebullient, less discombobulation. <laughs> that would be a really awesome mix. <laughs> Um, so fascia works on the whole system. So when we work on our bones, we only, we only work on the bones. When we work on muscles, we only work on muscles. When we work on fascia, it works on everything. So that's a really interesting concept. It's an overarching modality. You know, it helps with the emotions. It helps with all sorts of physical diseases. People are healing themselves left, right, and center. I haven't even gone into the testimonials yet or really done a deep dive into that, but just from the little blurbs that I'm healing or that I'm hearing, I know how amazing I feel after I do it for 15 minutes. It is so peaceful. It is so freaking expansive. I feel like me. This is who I am. You know, when I can step into my being because the chatter, the mind chatter quiets down, the anxious thoughts just dim, you know, my aches and pains, they dissipate and it's just a peaceful flowing. They are working on um, fundraising because as I said, Everything is open sourced. Nothing is behind the paywall. They do have retreats that they charge and they are they have a profit margin on their supplements. So they are doing hardcore fundraising. I think I heard they wanted to raise ten million dollars. You know, they are they're passionate about this. This sort of thing takes money. Even my little channel takes money. You know, I bought myself uh, an expensive phone so that I could have better quality, better quality videos. I had to up my phone plan a lot. It's actually quite expensive so that I can upload videos so that I can talk to people on zoom so that I can have lives, you know? So I can't even imagine what their overhead is. They don't draw salaries. They're living a very minimalist lifestyle. I'm just going to say it again, just massive respect for them. And they have, they have what they want to uh, fundraise. They have it all broken down and they want to continue to provide this for free. They want, they're doing world tours. They've, they've postponed it right now because things are just a little bit uncertain and shaky right now. And people are tending to, they're not, people are like closing off into themselves a little bit more going inwards instead of being out and about. So they thought, you know what, we'll just take a, we won't, we'll take a pause on the touring, but they, they want to go to different countries and really have a, a big impact. They want to provide supplements to those that can't afford them. They want to expand their programs to children and parents. And I'm not able to donate I am able to sit here and talk about them. I am able to show you guys what it looks like. I am able to teach it. And that, so that's what I'm going to do. That will be my contribution. I want us all to feel good. I want this family, as many of you, to join this. And let's work it ourselves together. And let's motivate, encourage, and support each other through this. Oh, is there anything else?
give it give it a try you know if you're on board for for committing to two months with me that's awesome if not try doing these maneuvers for i'd say seven days you know go on youtube find their upper or lower reset or just scroll through their videos even their shorts their shorts have a lot of um maneuvers that just take a minute or so like in a couple of minutes you can you can greatly help headaches or this pain or that pain by working on a specific body part so their shorts are very informative give it seven days and just see how it feels you know don't just push it off and if you say that you don't have time if you say that you're too busy you hurt too much you're too sick all that sort of shit man that's when you really need to stop and just fucking do it okay this is me pushing back just a little little bit just fucking do it okay please <laughs> i have to add a please because i am a polite canadian <laughs> okay so find me on the app uh you can they have a, a direct message system there so message me and uh i can connect a bunch of us you know let's say that there's 10 of us who want to do this I'll, i can connect the 10 of us and we can sort of keep tabs on each other and encourage each other you know starting new habits starting new routine uh sometimes we need to keep each other accountable so if that's what needs to happen here, then we'll figure that out. Um, yeah, I am going to make uh, a video right after I press stop here now of doing some of the maneuvers so that you can see what I'm talking about. And maybe that'll further motivate you to check into it and to go along this journey with me. I'm so excited i'm so excited this has just been literally the hugest piece just clunked into my life not clunked but you know it was just it just was slowly maneuvering itself into my life and then it just it settled into place with just that's what the that's the clunk i'm clock i'm talking about and it feels amazing so i'm gonna share it with you now I love you all so, so much. I am so honored to have you walking beside me. I'm so honored that this family keeps growing and growing. Um, if you're new here, when you subscribe, I have a little pebble that represents every person who subscribes and i put you into a, a, a pebble jar with some spring water and i pour lots of love light healing energy into there and it's it's really powerful to have the representation of 1700 people plus a wide variety of animals of different trees in there all together you know we are a collective we are rubbing off on each other even if it's just as pebbles <laughs> okay i can't see how long i've been talking but i imagine that it's been long enough so namaste dear ones i am so so looking forward to this next part of the journey where some of us will step into this with more intention with commitment and deliberately i don't like that word we will intentionally walk beside each other until two minutes from now <laughs> i'm gonna make that other video now